Okay, we're not having bunions, onions, no vegetable patches. Like, I love my vegetables, but not on my toes. Like, it's not giving. Hey, gems, it's your Miss Jamima, and we are back at it again with another video. So, today, we are going to be doing a fall shoe haul, and for the most part, these will be booties, but I do have some other items in here too, so let's get into it. But before we do that, make sure you're subscribed, because we are so close. We are so close to hitting 100K, so if you enjoy the content, help your sis, okay? Help yourself, because how, how you gonna see me if you don't subscribe? How you gonna see me if you don't press on the, the, the notification bell? What if I drop and you miss it? And you love the content, sis. That's why you keep coming back. You love the content. So help me and help you for the free skis. Subscribe. <laughs> okay, now let's get started. <laughs> So first things first, we had these super cute shoes from Guess and I got these in a size 11 and honey, look at these shoes y'all. Who do I think I am? Who do I think I am with these pink shoes? Like girl, like is this Jamima or is this Jamima 2.0? Like look at me buying pink shoes. Like, and nobody put a, uh, 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 to my head. This is free will. Purchase free will. Now, I did order these online, and these aren't the color that I thought they were going to be. I thought they were going to be, like, more of a hot pink fuchsia color, and it's very much giving a step above Barbie pink, okay? Um, I decided to keep them anyways, but, you know, I mean, it's just... It's the color for me, and I'm actively working on adding more color, more print into my closet, into my wardrobe, just because I shouldn't have to wait until I have like an outfit that needs a pink shoe for me to go out and buy a pink shoe. Like I feel like there are certain staples that my closet needs in general. And so I bought these for an outfit, but it doesn't even go with the outfit, so. But I was like, they're cute anyways, and for the winter, I am investing in more pumps. Um, I had stopped wearing point toe heels years ago because um, I was buying them in like half a size to a full size too small because I don't like when my feet comes out the back of the shoe. I like for my feet to be snug in a heel, so tight point toe heels means bunions okay so i stopped wearing point toe heels so i can let my feet heal and now my toes girl they're giving cash up worthy okay so i'm like slowly venturing back into the point toe heel world um but this time i'm staying in my lane okay i got these in an 11 i made sure there was room um because we're not having the bunion situation okay we're not having bunions onions no vegetable patches like i love my vegetables but not on my toes like it's not giving um so yeah but i was like look at me wearing pink who am i who am I right now? But yeah, so getting more pumps. And I got these from Nordstrom. <laughs> next. <laughs> so next I have these boots from Nine West. And honey, Nine West has been taking all of my coin lately because they are here for the Bigfoot baddies. Like, and I appreciate it, okay? So I believe I got these in a size 12. And you're going to see that I have several boots from Nine West in this haul. Um, just because they were giving what needed to be gave. And it's really that simple. They had the colors that I wanted. They had the, the heel height that I was looking for. Um, and the size. Baby. <laughs> and it had a sale. Okay, listen. That's the formula right there. Take my coin. So I got these beautiful animal print red boots here. Heels are generally very uncomfortable and very painful for me. So anytime a brand can add any little bit of comfort, any extra cushion, I appreciate. Mm -hmm. So I got the same exact style boot, but in ivory. Because y'all know, if I love something and it has multiple colors, I'm getting all the colors. And I really wanted to hop on a white boot trend, y'all. <sighs> I have not worn white shoes since I was a child, okay? 
I was against it for the longest time, but then I'm just like, wow, Jamima. It was like a curtain has unveiled and I can now see the light. Because baby, when I tell you I love these boots, these go with so many outfits. I'm just like, why did it take me so long to get some? I am in love with these to the point where I physically have to restrain myself from pulling these out. Okay, I physically have to hold myself back. I gotta hold myself back. You know how hard it is to hold this big body bends back? Do you know? It took all my courage to keep myself back from wearing these with every outfit. I didn't want y'all to drag me on the gram. I didn't. But these are so fire. Oh my God. I love that. Who am I? The queen of black everything has white boots? It's a brand new person. Okay. Next. <laughs> now, I did some shopping on Zappos. And I found these boots here. And I feel like these are the perfect fall boots. Just because... It's like half boot, half sandal. <laughs> it's like, it's a little chilly outside, but we're gonna let a little breeze in just to keep you at a neutral temperature, just to keep you cool, calm, and collected, okay? We don't want you too hot, but we don't want you too cold. And I feel like this is the perfect balance. <laughs> like, we all cover, but then the little nubbies got a little air, the little ankles got a little air, okay? So make sure you lotion up, cause I'm guilty of that, honey. Girl, I would lotion my whole body, but my ankles and my feet. Bruh. <laughs> so, um, yeah, when I ordered these, I actually didn't realize, but these are Michael Kors. Yeah, so I got these in brown, count yet, and I also got them in black. But yeah, Zappos coming through. Do y'all still shop on Zappos? I used to shop there a lot back in the day, but I'm just like, nobody talks about Zappos anymore, so. Do people still shop on there? I don't know. But yeah, so these are the shoes. These are the shoes. Oh, oh. Why am I throwing the shoes like they don't have boxes? Just making more mess for me to pick up later. Oops. You ain't cleaning, but you want to make a mess. How do I make this? But this is the black version. Here we go one more time. Everybody's feeling fine. Here we go now. Ooh, sexy. Don't even know if I can walk in them yet. I haven't worn them out yet. Say a prayer. <laughs> so next I have these Steve Madden boots right here, which I adore. Oh my goodness. I love these booties so much. And I actually got these from Zappos too. I'm just, I'm just in awe. Like, hello, patent, um, what is this, coffin toe? A decent heel. Listen, I... I love them so much. I love them so much. Y'all look it. And it's just a unique shade of brown. I don't have shoes this color. Like it's not quite calm yet. But it's not like a deep brown either. It's like a, a caramel brown. Mmm. It's like the, the nice gooey part of the inside of a snicker bar. You know when you break it apart and you, you pull it and it's just like mmm. That's how these boots make me feel. And then your mouth starts drooling. That's how these boots make me feel. Oh, they're so sexy. Oh my God, I love these. Get into it. Get into it. Okay, period. Oh, I absolutely love these. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. So next I have these mule heels here. Okay, first. Um, I have these heels from the Amazon drop and I've been looking for a nice pair of heeled mules for quite some time. So when I saw these, I was like, let me get this in the brown and the black. Now, did I get a brown and a black? No, of course not. They sent me brown and brown. And of course, when I went back to check, the black was out of stock. So, alas. Here we are with just the brown. Um, but I actually haven't worn these out yet. Ciao. I've had a stack of these boots right here for so long. Waiting to film this dang video. <sighs> I was waiting for some other shoes that I ordered, but then I... It, 
I didn't like them, so I returned them. So I could have been, you know what? It's a stress for me. Okay. Um, but yeah, so I got these from Amazon Drop. I forgot who. <coughs> I forgot whose collection came out when I purchased these, but I was like, perfect for fall. Once again, you get the booty aspect. Most of your foot is covered, but you're not encapsulated in like a lot of bootiness. <laughs> If that makes sense. So you still have a little room to breathe, but you're still warm. Um, but yeah, super cute. Super cute. Um, I know y'all gonna be in the comments talking about, oh, why didn't you show us the shoes? Show us the shoes. First of all, my feet ain't done. Okay? My feet is crispity crackety. Okay? My feet look like my scalp. My feet, whoo, she needs some milk. Okay, she needs some milk. She needs a, a, a good hour soak and a good scrub and a good uh, gel polish. All right. Um, it's been some time. I don't. I didn't realize how much time it's been since my last nail appointment, and it's long overdue. And I love y'all, but I'm not finna be on the internet looking like this. I'm not. I'm not. Um, so just imagine my feet look good in all of these. That's why I kept them. Okay, I, I don't know. I, I ain't got nothing else for you right now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Next, I have these boots here, which some of you may have seen before. I featured these in my Walmart haul. And baby, I love these. Okay, these give me Doc Martin vibes. They give me like rugged, edgy vibes, but... For the low, okay. Now these look huge. That's in that sentence. They look huge, um, but they fit. <laughs> Did I get these in a twelve or eleven? I got these in eleven. But the style of the shoe is bulky, so they're gonna look bigger than the norm. Um, and I do like that it has platform and a heel, so you're still comfortable, but you have a little bit of that height, which I love. And the laces, I feel like the laces and the hardware makes it pop. I just love these boots. They're so cute. I might wear them tonight. I think I will wear them tonight. Mm. With the red fedora or my burgundy fedora. Ooh. Because the lace is red and black, but from far away it looks burgundy because the black mixes with the red. Ooh. That's going to be a cute look. All black with the dramatic black jacket. Or my red Red Dolls jacket and my fedora. But if I do a red jacket, I'm probably do a black fedora. Because a red jacket and a red fedora is doing a lot. It's a lot. It's a lot. Wow. I really love black. Black has me in such a chokehold. It's actually not even funny. Anyway, I'm off topic. It's the ranting off topic situation for me. Anyways, this is her. So cute. Absolutely love it. And if you guys saw that video, you'll remember that I mentioned having ordered another pair of boots that were pre-order and they were delayed. So I finally got them in the mail and I'm finna show y'all. <laughs> so these are the boots that took for freaking ever to come. Once again, that white, that white got me in a chokehold and I was like, yo, like, I don't know if I'm gonna love these boots, so let me not get an expensive pair. Let me get something cheap from Walmart. And I'm obsessed. And I'm actually glad I went this route because why pay more when I could pay less? <laughs> um, so this is how they look. And once again, they look huge, but I don't even care. And I'm pretty sure I got these in 11 too. And I'm like, this is so different for me. I've never really worn boots or shoes in this style, but I'm here for it. Like I am so, here for it girl when I tell you I put it on and I was walking all around here like a child trying on her mama's shoes and heels like <laughs> just prancing around I'm just like wait a minute this is so my vibe now and it's so funny like watching my my style come to life like as as a big girl <laughs> It's hard to cultivate your own sense of style because you just wear whatever you can find that fits. Um, so like watching me pick out things that I actually enjoy from the increasing amount of clothing options that are available for us. It's like, that's interesting. So you would pick this over this. So I guess you're, I don't know. I don't know how to classify my style. I really don't. But um, 
I don't know, this is really cute though. That was a really random tidbit that really has nothing to do with the video or this shoe, but yeah, I like these a lot. <laughs> I just like these are so cute. Next, y'all, I went and got me some Nike boots. Listen, I went and got me some Nike boots, okay? Like, so this is the year, the first year where I can say I've really started wearing, like, sneakers. And when I think of, like, sneakers and, like, that era when people were, like, press, press, I think of high school and, like, middle school. But right up there with sneakers and the Jordans, all that was the Nike boots, okay? Baby, I was never like a big fan of the Tims, but the Nike boots, uh, a man in Nike boots, well-dressed and smells good. Oh my God, I was here for it. And I'm just like, bruh, not me out here buying uh, <laughs> these Nike boots for real. Like, the girls are out here trying to be more feminine and I'm trying to be more masculine. This is why I ain't got no nigga, cause I am a nigga, okay? And I'm finna take your bitch. <laughs> oh god. But I was like, when I saw these, I was like, oh my god, these are so sexy. Can you imagine me in all black with these on? Ugh. When I tell y'all I cannot wait to wear these, oh my god. I don't know why I'm so obsessed with Nike boots. But I'm just like, it's so nostalgic to me from like, in my high school days, because I was not that cool kid. I mean, I was decent. I feel like I finessed, and because I was just cool with people, I was able to skate on by. So I wasn't really like bullied or anything like that. Not by the school anyways. Child, the family, something else. But I also wasn't that cool kid either. And I feel like this makes me feel like such a cool kid now. Yo, I'm so glad I didn't peak at high school. That would have been real sad for me because I did not peak at all. So if that was the highlight, that would have been very scary. <laughs> very scary indeed. So I think that's why I love these so much, despite the fact that they're all black and I love black. Um, which is what they represent for me. Okay, next. <laughs> we almost done, y'all. We almost done. Yeah, I can't believe I really got me some Nike boots. Wow. Last but not least, uh, I got these from, I'm gonna say Ross. Good old Ross, okay. I got the fake uh, Balenciagas, the Folenciagas, or the Calvin Kleiniagas. <laughs> I was like, oh, these are cute. <laughs> I was like, mm, are we gonna do the Folenciagas? And I said, yes, <laughs> I do. Um, and I'm glad I got them from Ross because, you know, they're cheap. Um, because I'm like, I don't know how. Oh, wait a minute, these were not that cheap. And the first thing, not $44.99. Bruh. $45. I mean, they're cute, don't get me wrong. But dang, $45? Ross, you, you're getting a little spicy, all right? Simmer down. $45? I got got. <laughs> but they are cute though, my little Valenciagas, period. The shoes with the socks, okay. Does that mean I don't have to wear socks with these? How that work? How do you put them on? $24.99. I've never felt so disrespected in my life. But yeah, so these are the last shoe. I feel like this classifies as a fall shoe because you got the shoes with the socks. <laughs> You gonna be real warm in this, sis, okay? And you got a little extra protection in the front, okay? Cause you know, this right here is soft now. You got a little protection unless you need to stop somebody, okay? Stomp one of these dudes when they got you messed up, period. When you gotta, it's a stomp. That's the wrong song. I can get that stomp in there, my air folk. No, it's a stomp and air folk. Child, that's the cue for me to end this video now. But yeah, um, I'm very happy with all these purchases. Um, I feel like I have a good mix of casual, dressy, and chill. And um, I feel like this fall, winter season, um, uh, my style is a little bit more on the androgynous, and um, I love that for me. Um. So why am I here looking like a man in these streets, but smelling um, very much like Burberry Her? <laughs> Actually, my cologne game has been popping recently. So 
Listen, I might be out here stealing your girl. Watch your back. <laughs> but that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed our little chit chat with my favorite fall shoes. Um, I know I didn't show them on my feet, but I hope that you saw the vision and that you saw something that maybe you were interested in. I will have all the links for you available down below. Some of them may be affiliate links, which means that it doesn't cost you anything, but it does help me a lot when you use that particular link. Um, so shout out to the gems for supporting your gem. <laughs> uh, that is it for today's video and I will see you in the next one. Toodles. <laughs> so I can get the stomping in my Earth Force Wounds, big boy. Stomping in my Earth Force <gasps> Did I even show my Air Force Ones? I mean, I didn't get those recently though, so will they even qualify? Did I show them in another shoe off? Child, now me giving myself my work. This video over.